It might seem that the current calamities facing America, and the world, are all coincidentally occurring simultaneously as a byproduct of government incompetence, or corporate greed, or political malfeasance, however, it was all planned out years ago. Globalist institutions, such as the Rockefeller Foundation, offer a glimpse into what the globalists have planned for the world, from their own documents and even their own website. Their plan has been in the making, probably for many decades or even longer. Hunger and starvation is in the works as part of the Great Reset Initiative, outlined by the World Economic Forum. The now demolished Georgia Guidestones long foretold, they want a planet comprised of fewer people, and they want it now. The food shortages and inflation are no accident. Part of the plan to reduce the world's population is by depriving people of access to real food. Instead, they want a much smaller human herd, eating bugs and GMO. The plan is to deconstruct the current world order and replace it with a brand new one. The Rockefeller Foundation report outlines a coming hunger and nutrition crisis unlike any America has seen. Reset the Table was released just one month after the WEF announced plans for its Great Reset. WEF members all around the world are leading their respective countries and directing more of their citizens deeper into a human cage trap by advancing the agenda with each passing day. Once America's critical food assets are damaged or deconstructed, then Reset the Table and the Great Reset at large will be more overtly put into place at an accelerated pace. We're clearly witnessing the Hegelian dialectic at play, with the globalists causing the problem, waiting for the reaction from the sheep, and then giving them the solution they had planned out, long ago.